run free and dive into the sky. Hear the wind crying out its prayer. Why are we so ashamed to be alive? Break the chains and our freedom is ours to take. Thank you so much. I I appreciate it. You helped me save this kid. I just kind of like, you know, jumped in. I thought closing my eyes might have been enough, but uh, I guess I can't really fight with my eyes closed, huh? <sighs> Naive and competent delivery woman asking to be turned to stone. Uh, at least you're not the statue, but. Yes, you should probably be a bit more cautious and think a bit more before you jump into situations like this. Because otherwise, you wouldn't have saved anything, buddy. Yeah, I got a lot more to learn before I leave the Knight Academy and become a Fire Kingdom Knight. <laughs> uh, I'm afraid that that's not really a testament to skill. <laughs> Uh, delivery men and women are not very impressive. <laughs> Look, I'm trying to be a knight so I can help people. Like, everybody in this small village or that small child you just helped save. That's all. I want to learn to be my best and help all the innocents I can. I hope to also make a better path for the knights in the kingdoms, you know? Mm. Well, you'd be the first of scum to do that. <laughs> After all, most of the knights in the kingdoms are just pretty criminals who get away with what they do. <laughs> I don't want to be like that. I just want to help people. And I have my own people to take care of. I just want to make sure that this world can be a peaceful place, even if I have to sacrifice a bit of my own peace for it. Well, I suppose that is a... Honorable. Well, I wish. However, <laughs> in this type of world, it's unlikely. <laughs> well, goodbye, naive delivery woman. Hopefully your incompetence disappears with time. <laughs> the name's Olia! Hmm. It seems according to... Trader this is still a caravan should be moving through one of the wreaths soon. 
from the ice king to a fire kingdom shipment, it seems. Hmm. I might want to intercept that. The resources being delivered might be bad for me. Hmm. I'm going to need to be prepared, though, in case the caravan is heavier guarded than it says. After all, considering I've been hitting their shipments and camps, they may be on their toes. Siren flute granting the ability to, to uh, make the guards lose their concentration on easier targets. A cockatrice scepter to wither away their life. Hmm. Pixie wand I can leave. However, Gorgon head I might want to have in my back pocket. Well, it's a one time use if. I if I truly do get backed into a corner by something, it might be best for me to have that as a get a jail free card. However, no matter what, I cannot use that on the dragon. I will not permit myself to do such an act. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else in the armory that I may want to take? Tide Guardian shouldn't be that useful. So we're not in the water. Magic resistance may be helpful. However, the, due to the nature of the shipment being in a forest, I think it would be more logical to pair against weapons such as swords and close quarters combat. If I see somebody take out something to use a spell against me, I always have my Hydra arrows to counter and paralyze that target. After all, all I have to do is remove the tool from their hands and their magic is nullified. I suppose the best case to go with then would be Ice Dragon Steel that I have stolen from a shipment in the past. It is thicker armor than the guards and has a decent weight to it. However, due to how I've used it multiple times in the past, I should be able to maneuver fine. Hmm. It's been a bit since I've got this Gorgon head. Kind of amusing how it just sat in the possession. <laughs> uh, if I remember correctly, the guard that uh, I met when uh, I got it was quite ignorant and naive. <laughs> uh, I wonder if she's died yet. I mean, she doesn't uh, seem like the type to last that long. <laughs> she did seem pretty helpless. Let's just go get to the shipment. Damn it. Not another trade route. I didn't think it'd happen if I was here. Huh. Oh, great. Of course it's the incompetent delivery one. <laughs> hey, you're the Let's... Gorgon dude from <laughs> all those years back. What are you doing attacking Kingdom... Trade routes. <laughs> You're simply giving your kingdoms what you deserve, as I told you a while back. The kingdoms are nothing innocent. <laughs> or anything good, either. <laughs> now put that sword down, unless you want me to disarm you. No, if you're gonna try and kill me like you did everybody else, I'm gonna fight back. Because believe it or not, <laughs> I have someone I love back at home I have to return to. If I was gonna kill you without a second thought, I would have let the Hydra arrow go and let you be paralyzed and unable to fight back in the first place. You're lucky that I've ran into you before, otherwise you would have been on the ground without a second thought. <laughs> then why haven't you killed me yet? Well, 
Simple, really. B back then, you uh, told me that you wanted to be better than these scum. <laughs> so, what's the point of wasting such potential, even if you're wearing that disgusting armor? I've made it to Commander. I've been helping how I can. I even made it so that this caravan was pulled by horses instead of dragons. Mm, doesn't prevent any more deaths. It, if anything, it just uh, simply just delays their shipments and makes it a bit easier for me to get my vengeance. But it is what it is. <laughs> I'm sure Frost probably appreciates that more than I would. <laughs> what is it you want? What? I can't just attack it care of them like I have them? <laughs> the Noctua were disrespected and hunted by the kingdoms. It's only fit for the less remaining hunter to come after the kingdoms. Does this mean if you see me again, you're more likely to kill me? Hmm... Well, if you give me a reason to. <laughs> I won't give you a reason to, but I'm still going to keep doing my job. I need to be able to support my love. Support back home. who? Someone I'm oh, taking it's, care of. It's a little incompetent you. guard uh, head over heels for somebody. It's so adorable. <laughs> My cousin asked me to take care of her, and that's been what I've been doing. I'll do anything to make sure she's safe from anyone. Anything? <laughs> but what about make a deal with a devil such as myself? <laughs> what would this deal be? Simple, really. You make my job easier, and make it so I don't have to keep sneaking into your uh, unguarded libraries, stealing your records for information. <laughs> so you want me to give you information? If you're willing to do anything, then it shouldn't be much for you. Especially with your position, now should it? Fine then. As the Ice Kingdom commander, I will get you your information. <laughs> Isn't that a good girl? <laughs> now why don't you get running back to the little love of yours? Don't condescend me. I'm not the same <laughs> idiot I was back when we first met. I've learned At a lot more. At least you acknowledge your ignorance. I'm a lot stronger now, but if we have a deal. All right. I have yet to see anything to attribute to your strength, however. I suppose I'll keep my opinion reserved until you have an opportunity to prove you're not the same ignorant girl. But, I suppose you should run, run along now. Last thing you want is for any uh, people to stumble upon you here with me, of all people. <laughs> Go report to your little kingdom that your uh, caravan was lost. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna have to do. Good day. <laughs> well, bye bye now. <laughs> Ignorant little delivery girl. Well then, that was a uh, episode of DLL. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, if you did enjoy, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. This is Vortex signing out. Peace.